picks of the week. My pick this week um, is something we use every week here at the network. I uh, suncast VNCs into our studio uh, when uh, I'm not here. And he was on vacation a couple weeks ago. And I panic. <laughs> I'm like, how? what am I going to do? How am I going to you know, tap into the studio and Skype in and do all that stuff that he does without uh, you know, having him around? So he, he told me to install a VNC client on my Mac. And I, found, and I installed a bunch of them. Uh, I yeah. mean, I have a bunch of these VNCs and I have a uh, splash top and uh, as far as a VNC goes, and I'm going to do another service in a couple of weeks, but as far as a VNC goes, the one that really worked well for me was, and the only one that worked well for me uh, was Jolly Fast VNC. Uh, I don't know if you guys could see my screen here, but Jolly Fast VNC, uh, it's a standard VNC client. You could buy it on the website or you could buy it in the Mac app store. I bought it on the Mac app store. You could try it for free. By downloading it, I believe you get a trial. Uh, it's extremely fast. Uh, it works extremely well. Very stable. Uh, so let me show you guys how it works. So I'm going to VNC into the studio right now. Uh, into the studio. So I have all these computers here. I have a bunch of them. So these are all the computers on my network. Uh, I find the one that I want to do. Uh, I hit connect. Oh, you know what? My IP changed. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. <laughs> that's the same so, problem I had. So have. that's not going to work because my IP changed. But you pretty much get the point. You <laughs> VNC in. The reason why I like this one opposed to the other ones, I had a major problem. And I don't know if it's because it's coming from Mac to Windows. I could not click on anything. So when I would do click on something, there was a massive delay. And I had opened up the right ports and all of that. It just wouldn't work properly. Uh, Jolly Fast VNC was the only one that really was almost real time. I mean, the latency was very, very little. Uh, and uh, it worked really well. I know a lot of people ask how we control it, you know, remotely from other computers. Uh, Jolly Fest VNC uh, for the uh, the Mac. Right now, I'm going to be fired because you have a replacement and you don't need me anymore. I don't need you anymore. That's it. I'm screwed. Now let me ask you: With VNC, there's nothing that works seamless with with the high visuals, right? No. I as mean, far as I know. Yeah, I mean, I'm trying to find something, I, and I do want to implement Go to Meeting because I know Go to Meeting uh, works. But I know a lot of these softwares don't do audio as well. This Jolly right. Fast VNC does audio. Yeah, it, that's something that you're starting to see more and more now is, is these remote applications that actually do audio as well. Yeah, this does audio, and it's very necessary when you know uh, we're doing a remote show. Let's say Suncast wants to control the show, and I don't want to do it. He can listen in, rem uh, you know, remotely through the VNC client uh, on his desktop and be able to switch the camera.